rare mega pack. I'm expecting a walkout. It is going to be a walkout. Come on, let's be massive. Come on. It is what? Wait, who is that? Wait, Messi, come on. Ronaldo. Yes, boys, welcome back to this brand new FIFA 19 Ultimate Team pack opening video. This is going to be a rewards video, as you can see on the screen. I've got Weekend League rewards. It's gold 2, I'm pretty sure. And then I'm not too sure what Division Rival rewards. I think he might be rank 1 or maybe rank 2. And I think he does get two Ultimate packs, but we will see very, very shortly. But I don't usually make videos on rewards anymore, as you do know. I've been making a few more pack opening videos. I did make one yesterday on the footy cards. So make sure you do go ahead, watch that video. If you do go ahead and enjoy it, make sure you do drop it a like. Same with this video, of course. Make sure you do drop a like on it. Subscribe to the channel as well if you are new. As you can see on the screen here, we're at 2,700. And 15 subscribers something like that now which is just massive uh, I really do appreciate your support recently we've got 623,000 total channel views which again is just massive we've been growing so so quickly so thank you all so much for the support it really does mean the world um, but obviously yeah we have got gold two rewards today which is very very big obviously it isn't the greatest rewards in the world but it's still rewards because as you can see on the screen we've got best of packs um, so it's pretty much loads and loads of players that are in packs we have got obviously an SBC most likely coming at 6 p.m. so this video most likely will come out after the SBC that does come out because I probably will make a video on the rewards and then the video on the SBC as well Currently, we did obviously get the voting SBC yesterday, and then we got the ones to watch SBC, stuff like that. Not the greatest SBCs, but I'm expecting something big today. But without, before we do get into the rewards, I'm going to go ahead and show you some pack look that people did get. So as you can see here on the screen, this was someone's ultimate pack yesterday. Um, he did get Fabinho in the front, and you're probably thinking, is that it? Why are you showing us this? But he got Fabinho, 98 Messi, Man of the Match Bernardo Silva, Inform Firmino, um, road to the final Ben Yedder as well I'll show it one more time in case you didn't catch it but I did post this on my Instagram thank you for 3.7k on Instagram that is massive as well uh, so make sure you do follow me on Instagram if you are watching the videos but you didn't know I had Instagram and then yeah that is that pack but as you can see here for the player picks we are hoping for something like this this was my boy T Awesome that did open this pack make sure you do go ahead and check his Twitch out stuff like that he does stream every day um pretty much he's got 98 neymar in his rewards which is just gigantic of course we would obviously hope for something like that today um and then i just thought i'd show you a few other packs so i did post this on my instagram as well as you can see here he's got 92 ramos this is from his ultimate pack yesterday of course a lot of people did open the ultimate packs i opened mine in my video yesterday make sure you do check that out if you haven't seen it already um and then, yeah, look at this as well. I just thought I'd show this. This is going to be an Instagram post tomorrow. Make sure you do stay tuned. This is someone's red rewards. Like, how is this even possible? He's got Ronaldo, Messi, Hazard, Lewandowski, Royce, Neymar, Suarez. Like, how is that even real? I truly do not even know how that's real. It's unbelievable. But we are going to dive into today's rewards. I'm going to quickly show you his squad. I'm pretty sure he did go ahead and get 99 Messi in a La Liga guarantee. He told me the other day. Yeah, he did. So he's played 31 games with Messi. I'm pretty sure he's enjoying him. Obviously a very, very good card. Very lucky to get him. The one pack I wouldn't open on his account and he gets the best player on the game, which is just gigantic, of course. But we are going to dive into the rewards today. We'll select the division rival ones first. He does like taking the untradeable. And obviously there's a lot of players that are in packs. So if we can get someone good from the two untradeable ultimate packs, that will be absolutely massive. Um... And then he does have gold two rewards, which we will redeem. I don't know if he did play all his games, but he did only get gold two. I'm pretty sure he usually is a gold one player. So obviously not the greatest from him. But we are going to start off, of course, with the red pick. So if we can get something like this, that would be incredible. If we don't, then it's a shame. But we will start off on the first red pick. Come on, let's get lucky. Come on. Oh, Falvin. That's not bad, actually. Falvin ain't bad. If you did watch the last rewards video on this guy's account... I did pack him a 93 rated Falvin. I don't know if he would use him, but taking a look at all of these cards, he isn't going to use Campbell. He's a very, very poor one. He isn't going to use that Yil Maz, I'm pretty sure. Three star, three star. Not the greatest player in the world. The only player here he would use is Falvin, so obviously we are going to take Falvin. But let me know down below in the comment section if you have opened your rewards. Who did you get in your rewards? I'll be happy to know, obviously. Make sure you do tweet me on 
Twitter, which is McCartney underscore Ben as well, and follow me on Instagram and DM me over there what you did get in your rewards. But this is going to be the second red player pick here. If we can get lucky in this, that will be massive. I'm not really expecting much, but I really am hoping for this guy to get like a Neymar, a Ronaldo, something like that. But into the second player pick, who are we going to get? Thiog. Oh, I don't know how to feel, man. I don't know whether that, that's not good, is it? Three star, two star. He's not going to want him. I know he's French, but I just don't think he's great. He's not going to get into his team. Thiago is good for SBCs if he does want to go ahead and do that. So we will take Thiago. Tell me if I'm making the right decision. I'm pretty sure that's right. Falvin Thiago from the red player picks. Considering how poor his red player picks last week were, uh, he did tell me how bad they were. Considering how bad they were, to be honest, I would say he's probably happy with that. Yeah, he, he didn't play all his games. He had five games remaining. Pretty sure he couldn't be bothered. Um, but yeah, considering 17 to 8, not the worst in the world. Let me know again, how did you do in your weekend league? Um, and what did you get in your rewards? But I've done a club tour on this guy's team plenty of times, I'm pretty sure. But I'll quickly go over a few players that he does have. Um, as you can see here on the front, he does have a money that he did buy. And then the rest of his team pretty much is untradeable. There's not much to it. He's got a lot of untradeable cards. Um... So if I do go to special, untradeable. Yeah, he's got a lot of untradeable cards. A lot of very good untradeable cards. But he's got Cancelo. This is who we got last week. He got Visca and that other guy, I'm pretty sure. I got him Mendy, Thiago Mendes, and then them two, of course. So he's got some quite good red player picks. But we are going to dive into the packs here, of course. Best of packs are out in packs. So I really am hoping for this guy that he does go, go ahead and get lucky. So into the first pack, it's going to be a rare gold pack, which is a 25k rare pack. It isn't going to be a board, it isn't going to be a walkout, it isn't going to be anything. It's going to be just a, a non-board card. It's a rare, of course, it's an all-rare pack. He did go ahead and get Marcano. Not the greatest pack, I can't lie, pretty poor. We'll list that Chelsea bad joke because you never know. Frank Lampard did go ahead and just sign uh, for Chelsea, of course, the new manager. So maybe people are picking that up for that reason. But he's got two rare mega packs. They're the tradable ones. And he's got two ultimate packs. So we will start on the first rare mega pack. I'm expecting a walkout. It is going to be a walkout. Come on, let's be massive. Come on. It is what? Wait, who is that? Wait, Messi, come on. Ronaldo. Ronaldo. Oh. I swear Ronaldo does have one, doesn't he? Or am I going crazy? But Ronaldo Sanchez, not a bad pull. I'm pretty sure he'd be happy with that. I truly thought he was going to get Ronaldo. I don't know why. Oh my god, he's 10k now. So I'll just send him to his club. He might want to use him, you never know. I truly did believe. I think Ronaldo does have a... Wait, what card is that? It's a road to the final, isn't it? Um, Yeah, Champions League, road to the final. So I did think Ronaldo. It could have been Ronaldo. It obviously wasn't Ronaldo. Um, but obviously we've got three more packs to go. He's got two untradeable ultimate packs, which I am expecting something big from. And then of course we do have the rare mega pack. I will go ahead and open the rare mega pack because it isn't as good as the ultimate packs. The ultimate packs never usually pay out. First rare, me second rare mega pack, sorry, isn't going to be a walkout. It's only, it's going to be a board, but it's not an informal man of the match or anything crazy like that. It is going to be Bauman. So yet again, not the greatest. I'm not going to lie. The red rewards didn't live up to the expectations of what we were looking at, of course, like this, this here, and then obviously Neymar there. Um, so not the greatest so far. I'm not going to lie. I feel like he would be happy so far. I don't think it has been that bad. I feel like it could have been way worse than it actually is. Obviously, if we did get Ronaldo, it would have made the video, would have made the title. Would have got a lot more views, stuff like that. But oh well. We have got the two ultimate packs here to make up for it. If we can get something huge for this guy. Obviously, I've shown you his team. I'm not going to go over that too much. But that is his squad there. So he does kind of need Premier League players. Um, he could probably do with a keeper. Maybe like a team of season Allison, A team of season Edison someone like that just someone like good in the premier league um we will get into the first ultimate pack i'm expecting walkouts in both of these if we don't i'll be extremely disappointed it is a walkout in the first one it is going to be a pink card so it is a carnival is it bale belgium center back oh I'm expecting hazard it's not even i've got one though has he so i'm sorry i'm not really up to date on who does actually have certain cards but it is lukaku in this one is there going to be anyone else in the pack if it is, then it would be massive, but there isn't. 
But he does get a good Lukaku card, of course. A 95 pace centre back. A very, very good. Very good super sub as well, if that's what he wants to do. He's got Falcao as well. He has got some duplicates in the pack. He does have a duplicate of this guy. Does he already have him untradeable? Yes, he does. So I probably am going to have to discard him. But he doesn't have any value anyway. So it doesn't really matter, I'm pretty sure. I don't think he would care too much. Simply because the guy doesn't, he just doesn't have any value on the market. He'll be discarded on the market due to all these packs. It's simply just how it works. Obviously, a lot of people are packing the same players. But we are going to have one more ultimate pack to end the video off. If we can get a walkout, that'll be gigantic. If we don't get a walkout, that'll be a massive shame. But yeah, we are going to open the final ultimate pack here. This isn't going to be the end of the video after this, but it is going to be another walkout, which is amazing, of course. It is going to be a man of the match, so there could be any... Oh, no, it's a scream card. It's a scream card. Ah. Oh. Cal Hanoglu, which is obviously great. Not great, it's a scream card, but when you get a scream card, there can still be a lot of other cards in the pack. There is going to be, oh, a Davies card, which is obviously a very good one to watch, an upcoming player, but with all the players in packs, I'm not going to lie, that is a letdown in my opinion. Let me know in the comment section down below. Would you be happy with these rewards that this guy did receive today? In my opinion, obviously... I'll be happy in some aspects, but then in other aspects, I'll be thinking, look at the players that are in packs. I feel like this is a little bit of a letdown, um, but I do, I do genuinely feel this could have been way worse. So let me know in the comment section down below what you do think about these rewards. I'll be interested to hear all of your thoughts. Definitely drop a comment. Also, make sure you do check my Instagram out and make sure you do check my um, other social medias out. There's links in descriptions. But he's got 170k now. He did build a little bit. Obviously, he's got the Thiago and he's got a few other players who he can throw in. But I'm going to show you a few more things that I do want EA to bring out throughout the year. Um, so as you can see on the screen here, I'd like, I see someone post this on Twitter. Um, I feel like it would be quite a good idea that EA do add ones to watches from the new clubs like just to add in to the end of the game maybe a new little promo obviously the game's slightly dying but we have got until september until the new one comes out so it is quite a while of course we're in july now so july august we have got a bit of time until september um so it would be good to see something like this come out obviously sarabia did just sign for psg so it would be great to get like a once to watch version of him and then we've got Juan Basaka who did sign for united of course two very very good cards on the screen as you can see and then as you can see here as well we do have Neymar which is also a massive massive card this is more looking at a FIFA 20 aspect type uh, type thing so if we can get this on FIFA 20 that'll be absolutely massive um, obviously we will be getting it if he does sign for Barcelona so again drop a comment down below do you feel that this Neymar will sign for Barcelona I'm very very interested to hear all of your thoughts so definitely let me know by dropping a comment down below but I really hope you have enjoyed the video Video. I'm going to show you one last image here. These are some ratings. Shout out to BD7 Games. These are some card ratings for FIFA 20. I just thought I'd end it on a high, of course. It is FIFA 20 coming soon. I know it won the greatest video in terms of pat look. Um, but do you agree with these ratings? Is there anyone you would change? Obviously, we've got Messi being the higher rated than Ronaldo, of course. Ronaldo has been higher recently the past three years, but that was due to like a contract, stuff like that. Do you agree with a 90 rated Mbappe, of course, being so young and being 90 rated is just huge. Um, obviously, Ramos, 90 rated. De Bruyne, downgraded by one rating due to his injuries, stuff like that. Obviously, Van Dijk now upgraded to the same rating as Ramos, which is deserved in my opinion. I truly do believe that Van Dijk is the best centre-back on the game. Aubameyang, obviously, still an 89. Sterling upgraded, upgraded to an uh, 89, but yeah. They are the players that are shown on the screen for FIFA 20, but I really hope you have enjoyed the video. Thank you all so much for the recent support on my channel. It really does mean the world. Thank you all so, so much. Um, but if you are new to the channel, make sure you do go ahead, drop a like on the video, subscribe as well if you are new. But that has been that on this guy's rewards. Make sure you do thank him and stuff like that in the comment section down below. I really do appreciate him letting me open his rewards every week. But I really hope you have enjoyed the video. I'm sorry it was a little bit of a long one. But if you have enjoyed, like I said, drop a like and show some support in the comment section down below. Hope you enjoyed and peace out.